and today it is mine. Uh, before I just get into my topic, I have a polling question for you all. I request my friends, please take a few seconds to answer this question before I just move on with my topic. Ajit sir, can we have the question? Yes ma'am, it's been polled. I request my friends, please select the two options out of it. Read the questions and select, take a few seconds of it. Yeah, ma'am, let me know when, when should I stop this polling. Yes, just two seconds, sir, because we are only 17 over there. Yes. Ajit sir? Yes ma'am. Shall I? Done sir? Uh, there are uh, still uh, only 13 of them have voted. Okay. Out of 18, 14 of them, 15 of them have voted. Okay, I'll, I'll stop uh, polling now. I'll, I'll share the results, ma'am. Yes. Fashion can make wonders in livelihood. 100% that is out of 15, 14 have voted for passion and one has been voted for saying that it is the profession which makes the wonders in livelihood. So taking this question as my base for today's platform, I wanted even that one person to be converted into 100%. I hope I can just uh, do the justification for today's topic. That is, turn your passion into your profession. Uh, my dear friends, uh, I would just ask you a simple question. That is, what is the purpose of your life? If anybody could answer in the chat box, if anybody would tell me what is the purpose of life, I think I can go ahead with my topic. The purpose of life. What do you consider a purpose? How do you say a purpose? What is a purpose? Yes, I have one answer saying that purpose of life is happiness. Yes, good. Can I hope? Few more questions, few more answers, sorry. Purpose of life. Satisfy ourselves. Good. Satisfy I'm achieve achievement. Achievement. And as of now, fight against corona. Good. So the purpose of life. See. A single sentence or maybe a single phrase what I have just used saying purpose of life. So a purpose can be viewed with a different angle from a different. See, we are 18 in this platform today and 18 of y'all have a, a different ideas of telling what is purpose. A purpose, as you all told, it is satisfaction. Purpose can be right now fighting against the corona or purpose can be an achievement. And I also feel you might be feeling like money is also a purpose because uh, money is a mode which we use it to fulfill all our uh, achievements, maybe achievements or all our desires to tell that. So maybe a uh, few people wanted money, few people wanted reputation that is achievement, few people like to eat a very good delicious food. That is what I mean to tell few people wants to buy a very big house maybe they feel a purpose of life is buying a very expensive house or buying an expensive car then having a delicious food or just having a bank balance just having a bank balance do you feel is this really a purpose 
just an achievement is it enough is money is it enough or just satisfaction is enough for us do you really call this as happiness uh, faculties i just wanted to tell you something purpose means it is ultimate happiness see whatever we wanted today is happiness maybe money which ultimately leads to happiness or maybe our uh, food like to eat it is also leads to our ultimately happiness or the reputation or the achievement what you have told a uh, fame that can also be an ultimately leads to an happiness see when you link all these parameters whatever we have just now discussed whatever the uh, parameters we have given the ultimate goal of our purpose is nothing but our happiness so as per my knowledge i say happiness can be of two types so before we get into happiness yes we will just go into something calling like we have just gone through three slides that is one is buying a house expensive cars having a bank balance having a delicious food or uh, something else what you call it a satisfaction please take a pause over here and look behind for 20 years or 30 years of yours mine it is 40 years so when i look behind of my 40 years i just see myself in the mirror that is this is me in the mirror today by the time i turn back and see today i am an age old that is my high sides are becoming worse my legs are becoming weaker and i can see the signs of a uh, uh, age old signs in my body over here so i thought a purpose of life was just the money purpose of life was just an achievement a purpose of life is sacrificing myself entirely to my family that was my purpose over here but when i turn back and saw myself what have damn did for this 40 years of my life i would rather see from outside this is mina what you are seeing from the uh, slides this is this is how has been happened for me now right now so after few days maybe i am 40 now maybe after 10 years i'll be out of my uh, making up my money or making my reputations or whatever it is so after few days uh, definitely the world will forget you the people around you may not take time to remember you so has i have got the answer saying satisfactions answer saying achievements answer telling fighting against corona right now yes we have done few things over here do you really call or do you really consider this as happiness this is the only question i wanted to ask today of my dear friends is this the happiness what we are all looking at see has an accounts teacher i would rather try to tally my balance sheet over here see when i try to tally my balance sheet over here my balance sheet showed me a deficit balance sheet where i had more thing to sacrifice and less to enjoy or less to be happiness over here so i just wanted to ask you all will you be happy with just the word of satisfaction or will you be happy with just a word of achievement so it's a question i'm just asking you people is this is enough for us in our world to live is this enough is money enough for us is all this luxury and life is enough for us is this you really consider it as happiness can anybody answer me see one fine day i have lost myself after 5 40 years of my age today i am trying to find myself and i hope many are also trying to find ourselves over here all these years we have done enough of things to our families enough of sacrifice we have been done don't you feel now this has to be changed into something what we love to do or what we feel like being happy in this so here i would just ask you a question is this really means and happiness is this 
really a happy what we consider it as is this the purpose of the life i can i have some questions on based on this answers on based on this i have no answers from your side please our uh, friends let us make it as a interactive session so i need an answer because this is a common uh, platform it is a common subject or topic whatever we have taken and everybody are in the mode of making something in for our life some purpose so can we have few passions i have uh, put a passion on the slide saying this a real happiness that is is money pay desire is your happiness or do you have anything else apart, apart from this do you call anything else is there for a purpose of life over here yes i have one answer telling that satisfaction is required to do what we do yes see ajit sir can i have a question here Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm going to launch that. Yeah. Passion should eventually become a profession. Yes or no? Uh, this is our second polling question. Passion should eventually become a profession. So can you have the results, sir? There are only fourteen of them have voted. Can I can I end the polling? Yes, sir. I'll raise it. Oh, that's okay. Yes, passion should eventually become our profession. And ninety-three point three percent. all our friends have agreed yes passion should eventually become our profession and one faculty or one friend of mine says no yes so uh, dear friends we are into this so today we are just going to talk about how passion can be converted or can be uh, can become a profession into our life uh, that is what we are going to discuss in our Uh, next slide okay so if at all all this years we have just sacrificed we have done so many things uh, or whatever we call it as materialistic in our life we have gone through all those materialistic and and now it's time to be happy so i wanted to be happy so after 40 years of my age i just thought let me be happy from your own words so let me make my passion into my profession so that that makes me ultimately happy so if at all you wanted to be happy in your life definitely you need to follow your passion so few few of them has see if it is our students generally they will not have a clarity telling that okay what is passion over here how can i take up a passion over here now i don't know how to take up a passion i am confused i don't have a clarity of taking a passion so will this passion lead to our uh, materialistic so called the money because a uh, money is very important to lead our enjoyable life or money is very important for us to lead our uh, livelihood over here so i just have six points my dear friends over here where uh, maybe you all know what is your passion maybe you can take up this topic to your uh, friends or to your students or to your uh, whoever you wanted to tell them so if at all so we will all travel in the six steps together so please take a pause for some time start identifying your passion so before we get into passion if 
I hope everybody knows the meaning of passion. Definitely, because you and I are faculties and you and I teach the students and we know what is the meaning of a passion. So if at all, I would like uh, just give a meaning of passion over here and then move on. So passion is ultimately not a talent. Passion cannot be a status. Passion cannot be our reputations. So what is passion? What do you call a passion as? So I'm, the, I'm just not reading whatever it is like. So I'm just telling whatever I feel what is my passion. A passion is one which you love to do. Or passion is one where you uh, learn, try to do creativity. See, for example, if you ask me, what's your passion? My passion is listening to music. You ask me to listen to music 24 by 7, I would rather listen to all those musics. Because I love music. I never get bored listening to musics. You ask me to hear to the music anytime. See, whatever may be the mood of mine, I start, when I start listening to music, I start enjoying myself. I feel happy myself. A uh, few of my friends would have observed me Many times, whatever the cultural activity takes place in the college, they would have observed me. As the music starts on the stages, I start dancing over here or I start singing along with them, forgetting the age of mine. I am least bothered about my age over here because I feel I want to be happy because my passion is music over here. And friends, you will not believe it. In these three months, what I have used, I have used to identify this passion and I have made few of my videos also but uh, uh, that should I am not shared in my any of my uh, social medias this videos is only for our uh, sisters so whenever we sisters get it together we start singing songs we start dancing together because that is our passion we love enjoy we feel happy when we do these things so that is my passion so you people also Try to see that, what is the passion? What is that love which gives you the love? What makes you happy? What which never makes you get tired? You ask me to do any time, you should be ready to do that. You should never say, I am bored, I am tired, I should get a rest. If you use these words, it means it's your profession. Okay, profession pays us. So we are into a profession to make a money. But I am talking about passion today. So when I say it is a passion, the passion should be something you love to do it. See, you have to be creative in doing it. Creativity is very important. See, when we love things, only then we start doing creativities. When we, are, when we don't like things, we just give it as cooked food to the students. Or we just give it as it is being done, baked. So we don't want to do that. We wanted to start creating something. So that first thing is to, this is a passion according to me. So let me summarize. I have a quotation over here. Why be a follower when you can be a leader? Live your passion, follow your dreams. This is what I meant to tell you. This is what is today's topic I wanted to tell you. Live your passion, follow your dreams. We have one of our best friend among us. Uh, maybe the person who traveled me in my uh, experience of this 20 years. A person, his passion is cultivation. But still he comes to the job. You know why? Because to get married. Because you get married, partner andre get married, you get married, you get professional you job married, you First, Kelo question would give money in the Uda Yava Kelsta Lidane and the head. Ah, one day was to intention only to get that degree and put it in the invitation and telling I am working, sir is forced to work, though he is not interested to work over here. So he never bothers to give anything creativity over here. He just tells, This is what is being asked from my side, and this is what I am going to do it. So I think. He is sacrificing so many things over there. So, friends, let, let us make a little changes over here. Let us start identifying what is our passion over here. So, passion, according to me, it is love, care, 
enjoy and never ever get bored and finally which ultimately reaches for your happiness i have just have few steps to follow this step 1 that is slow down slow down in the sense please take a pause over here stop whatever the work you have been doing with maybe from past 10 years or maybe from past 5 years immediately after your colleges take a pause over here start analyzing yourself please observe yourself what are you please come out of your body come out of your body and start imagining is this nina what i expected this is what the first question what we are going to ask am i happy with what i am doing today am i creativity in what i am doing today am i happy enjoying what i am doing can i do this same thing for 24 bar 7 every day this is the first question what we are supposed to ask ourselves my dear friends please remember only few of us could have made a passion into profession not everybody so this thing we will just take a pause we have run a long years of five years or 10 years or whatever the years we have run we will just take a break over here just a break of one day i'm not asking you to take a break of more than a year i am just asking you spend one day for yourself and start analyzing what is the activity you are doing what is the activity you are doing day to day and just and what are the things you are dumping into your work every day what are the activities what is that n number of activities you are dumping in a day so that you are not able to recognize yourself so come out of your uh, body start observing give a quality assessment to your body or to yourself and check out what is that you really require and just frame a phrase of passion what you want it to be a phrase a phrase tells makes a sentence you know what a phrase in an english a entire phrase gives a single meaning over here so try to identify yourself try to a uh, grish for example if i take grish sir with your permission sir if i say grish grish is passionate at doing it i feel a uh, grish sir is passionate at calligraphy because i have seen him writing uh, many things this is what i have observed in grish sir he starts creativity in writing things uh, he is passionate at writing poets i have seen him many times posting in a status poets so so there is so, so every creature in this world every human being who's born in this world i believe you have that inborn talent what you call that inborn talent if you tap it for yourself definitely friends you will be able to make it up see happiness can be of two types external happiness and internal happiness you start asking question over here external happiness is what we spoke in the previous slides that is uh, uh, that is purchasing of house and expensive cars money reputation we we do require all these things this is very important for us i do i do agree with this but these are the things of external happiness we also have an internal happiness over here so that internal happiness is as what is passionate so you should just give a break over here and start analyzing yourself and check what is your passion over here definitely at step 1 i think you will make an attempt over here to start analyzing yourself what is it i am doing day by day what are the activities i am doing day by day is this what i wanted to do it this is a question what you are going to ask yourself my dear friends today moving down to the second step writing a epithet it is nothing writing a phrase a phrase can be what you want to do what you want to accomplish and you how you wanted to read that in your phrase what you wanted to show to the world yourself has so finding is our second step so definitely friends definitely i do agree with this third step with the barriers see most of us uh, barriers for example i told my passion is music when was i able to tell this when was i able to recognize this passion music was my passion 
not early stages maybe after completing my college uh, definitely i will i would have been able but there there was not a proper i did not have a proper guide to tell me you know this is your passion go ahead with your passion if they would have told me also if somebody would have guided me also i wouldn't have followed my passion the reason is my family background i did i lost my father when i was studying in night and i since i was an elder daughter i i am supposed to take care of everybody in my house and that is why i was forced to go to the job immediately after completing my degree over there so see there is lack of barriers i am not just telling you a passion is immediately after identifying your passion you can get into the passion see to get into the passion also you have to list out the barriers my dear friends to see i had two of my barriers where i was not able one there was no proper guide for me to tell me that this is your passion go ahead with this we are there to support and again i did not have my family support because i had to take care over here so like this friends definitely if you have some barriers maybe few don't have clarity few don't have have clarity what is my passion how will i get into my passion few don't have confidence okay music what will music earn me maybe they will have how will my father parents support me for this definitely that will not earn money for me see few of the lack of confidence friends so once when there is some person to tap you and send you with the confidence definitely you will be able to get into that so here in the third step what we are required is frame all those hindrances what you are going if at all i take my passion what are the hindrances i am going to face list out all those hindrances check if you can overcome those barriers see manasidre margam please sorry friends if i make any mistakes in the kannada please kindly excuse me uh there is a quotation we generally tell manasidre marga anta where where there is a will there is a way that is what we generally tell right and a uh, quotation kododala easy name where there is a will there is a way and the quotation kodod it is very easy but getting into it is definitely a risky job only okay because the achievement of target achievement percentage is very less when compared to the profession over here but definitely believe me when you start analyzing all this uh, barriers like lack of clarity lack of confidence fear of failure of course what if i get into into that particular field what if i get into into cultivation what if i get into my calligraphy if i don't shine what will happen what is my future so definitely we do have all those barriers so please list out all those barriers when you list out those barriers you will have few things which can be overcome that is take charge of those barriers and uh, one more thing what would i would uh, like to tell us when you have those barriers in your life friends uh, maybe your fear maybe the confidence what i spoke to you uh, maybe there is no clarity maybe your lack in of purpose some might tell ma'am i have money i have everything i am happy with that i really feel a person without a passion we can call him a person without a pulse rate in his body every man has a passion no man will tell if i am have money i am happy with it because money cannot give happiness for that so purpose is not just making money over here purpose is making a passion so in the first we will start analyzing in the second step you will start making phrase out of it and the third step you will start making your barriers list and then in the fourth step you will start analyzing which can be which are the barriers can be eliminated from here which are the barriers that i can overcome over here i would just give an example over here uh, friends one of my relative guy he did not know what is doing till as engineering till as engineering believe me 22 years when he came out of his engineering he did not know what is decision making but still he did not want even to depend on his parents because his father was a barber 
so he did not want to go into that so he planned to get into some it company so as you and i know that every software engineers are seen in every hook and corners of it companies and this guy also went into an it company over there and after 5 years i'm sorry after the 5 months of his course he went through many companies for walk in interviews he was not selected and finally he went to one company where they he saw just a board of walk in interview and went into that he went and met the hr over there and hr he shooted some questions over there for him but trust me he was not able to answer any of the question but still he got the job there how did he get the job there the hr he only looked at the confidence level what he had when he came into that office when he entered into that hr he saw the confident level what he had and based on that confident level he just gave the job to him and you know what happened friends for 6 months he was just given some uh, uh, sort of uh, like uh, taking up some tests and he was not able to do those work and finally hr for the next 6 months he told uh, like he observed this guy and then he told you just start mailing few things i'll just give you some clerical work at least you learn uh, see an engineering student who has studied an engineering finally he held up with a mail sending a mail reply and that mail reply was also a text message which was already been ready it was only his work is to collect the message and send the message see and that guy used to be in the office only for one hour the remaining hour he used to spend in the cafeteria he was always in the canteen and this hr manager who gave the job to him he started watching him and he came to know that he is always there in the canteen chatting with everybody over there a chatting can be of any sort please remember 24 years guy what will he chat he will just chat whatever it is in and around him going on so he was just chatting those things over there and this hr was a person a friend a guide and philosopher for him he was a person who told him like why don't you try in a media because you are very good at communicating when you can spend more than 6 hours in a canton why can't you try in a media which requires you to talk for 24 by 7 over there and that day was a miracle for him he came out and he discussed the same thing with his father the father did not want him to leave such a good job please remember he was getting 29000 over there and father was not ready to lo- uh, ask his son to leave the job because entire family was dependent on him and one thing for friends here it was his friend who promised him to give the money for every month 10000 and he encouraged him to go up with the medias and you know what today he is very famous in chennai has mirchi vijay he is as a radio jockey he is working as rj and is very famous as mirchi vijay so decision making a passion he had a passion of talking communicating he communicating everybody can communicate what that made vijay very popular is the communication was in the different way in a humorous way he used to humor he used to talk in a very humorous way that made the differences and he had that uh, patience of listening to everybody that made him uh, 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 special from other rjs and that is why today i have taken him as an example in this topic so passion so few of my think what passion at this age passion can be at any age for that matter uh, friends and one more thing the examples whom i am giving it is only to my knowledge what i know and whom i am inspired i am giving it as an example and there is no bias in giving this examples so who i have inspired please don't take it otherwise why because mom is taking the example of chennai it is not because i am from tamil nadu because 
when i'm giving some information i should be very confident when i'm giving and it should be correct information that is why i have given you i'm trying to give this information so take charges see there was somebody to take that barrier or somebody was ready to give him 10000 rupees over there to run his day to day show and that is why he went into his passion and that is what i wanted to tell you in this fourth step that is take charge and then coming make a wish list a fifth step is make a wish list friends because nobody will have only one passion if i ask somebody over here you might tell ma'am i am very passionate say i just gave an example of girish sir he is very good at uh, calligraphy he is very good at talking he is very good at this is this is the things what i have analyzed he is very good at writing poets and he is also a very good listener what i felt like see he has so many things in us so see when they ask me i am also very good at uh, music i cannot sing please i will not sing also because my voice is not that good so definitely i will never sing but i am very good listener of music i am very good at dancing i have learned dancing from my childhood maybe i should have taken that as my passion and i have should have continued that that is what i have told you so here when i tell you make a wish list wish list can be of five wish list can be of 10 wish list can be 10 to 5 please constrain this wish list because a man cannot travel in all the five person cannot travel career to make a constraint over here on what basis are you telling me to constrain how did you tell me constrain from 10 to 5 5 to 3 simple friends please take three things when you are constraining one is will your passion give you income that is the first question the second question should be will it be happy for others it should be it should give happiness to others and the third thing is you should have an ultimate growth over there so with this three parameters my dear friends if you are able to make that three wish list one is our income the second one is it should give an happiness to others and the third one should be an ultimate goal why did i mention that word happiness is see only when you are happy you will pay for it what is our ultimate goal see we being a commerce student uh, sorry i being a commerce lecturer if i start investing 1 rupee i definitely need 10 rupee out of it that is what is my mentality see i just cannot say this is my passion and hence forth i am going to be in my passion i like music so the entire day i'll be listening to the music that definitely does not lead to our livelihood over here right so what so i should see my passion it should generate an income for me and it should also make others feel happy over here okay so when you are happy you are paid for it when the opposite sides are not happy you are not paid for it so these three parameters and again when i say with these three parameters i have chosen one as my passion and that you should have a depth to a uh, knowledge about that is you should be an expert friends you should be expert in that particular field for example if you wanted to see some would would you have a passion of teaching few people like what whoever are there in this platform they may be having a passion of teaching and teaching cannot be only coming to college and teaching teaching can be also be teaching at home tuitions teaching can also be a uh, uh, online teaching what we are doing right now a teaching can also be a training a training which is an ongoing business a booming business wherever you can see training a training center makes a miracles all these days so it does not mean that you should be if you if you want to be a if you love teaching it does not mean that you should be only a lecturer or you should only be a teacher you can also be a trainer 
if you are a trainer definitely training will give you an income over here a trainer will lead to be happy on the other side and believe me it is an ultimate growth when you start learning those things continuously so in that if you are expert at training you should have a complete knowledge that in depth knowledge is very important over here because see when i say passion i should know thoroughly what is that from a to z i know, i should know what is that from any hook and corner they can ask you the question you should be able to answer because when you be passionate you start finding things over there so you start finding things when you start finding things you start learning continuously see learning is not only the duty of a teachers or duty of a lecturers a learning can be done by anybody for that sort even a farmer learns every day whatever the day see initial stages when our ancestors were doing harvesting today the same harvesting method is not been followed definitely the technology has been changed and even he tries to learn something so if you are very passionate if you are very passionate definitely you should have your knowledge continuous learning you should learn continuously to upgrade yourself that is our third unlimited scope to grow yourself that is very important over here and a very very important is create a positive circle among yourself very important my dear friends when i say when i discuss hey i am very good at music and when the opposite person says hey you don't i don't hope so you are not good at music when they start giving us a negative feedback over here believe me we will not try to follow our passion so you always create a positive circle among you all those person should be able to give a positive ideas regarding your passions because we don't want to keep our passion ourselves we wanted a passion to convert into our profit we wanted to make our passion into our profession so if you wanted to make our passion into profession all these things that is first one is you have to put your uh, wish list over here for the wish list you need in depth knowledge because you have to expertise in those things and if you want to expertise and if you want to have a very good knowledge you should definitely have a very good a uh, positive circle among you see positive circle can be used for two things one they will uh, always uh, like to cherish our pa passion they will always encourage us to continue with our passion and another thing is they will try to give us a network which is very important network well network is very important for us to flourish see when i say very good at dancing and i start dancing at home to myself that doesn't mean i am going to earn anything over here when i say i am very good at dancing i can become a good dance teacher over here i really need some a good uh, positive network who can send students to me or where i can go and approach there so i just need a reference reference and that network should be a positive network friends so that is what i would like to tell in my uh, next that is uh, make list after making your wish list go public go public is nothing but start advertising yourself that is what i meant to tell you create positive is nothing but you are going to advertise yourself you are going to tell your circle i am very good at this this is what i am planning to do see if you don't go public if you don't announce it to the public telling that i am very good at this believe me your passion can never be changed into profession so definitely you have to go into a public when you go into a public your passion can be turned into your profit this is what ultimately everybody wants we want passion we also want profit so few examples i just have uh this is a pick don't mind with this pick uh just when you start following your passion when you start uh, making your passion into your profit you will start loving your job this is what every organization requires us to do 
This is what every con every industries, every organizations, every educational institutions they wanted us to do. We should love our job. Only when you start loving your job, you will become a legend one day. So this is what is the legends. See. When I just come in for Nagarjuna College and do the lessons and move out, one day or other they will definitely forget me. But when I start putting my creativity into that, that is when I start loving my job and making it as a passion, I can definitely be a legend over there. Everyone, whoever is there on this platform, definitely, everybody can become a legend. When? When we start loving things. When? When we start uh, being happy in doing it. And few of legends have done that. That is why even till today, we remember them. And uh, please don't mind the examples what I'm giving here is the examples of who I know, please. Kamala Hassan have put, he is an inspiration for me. Uh, I told you I am very good at music. I love watching movies because these are my passion. So I have taken these as my examples. Kamala Hassan I have given. Though he has been into his work, we call it as a job. He is right now 60 years. From the age of 5 till today he is working into the job. But you know what is the statement he gives? He just tells me, I am at rest. When a reporter asked him a question, Sir, are you not tired? Sir, are you not bored of doing it? Sir, don't you feel you have to take a rest over here? Because he is in the film industry for 50 years. And this was a question a reporter shooted at him and he told, I am at rest. This was the quotation. This was a phrase what he gave. Means he, he means to tell that was a passion and I love to do it. And I, I'm loving to do it. This will be continued in the future also. I have not thought about my profession. See, his passion was acting and he made that into a profession. And even till today, he tries to do all the creativities. I cannot see a man, I cannot see this person who have not untouched any of the fields. He has touched all the fields of the industries. He is like an all rounder for me. That's why I have just put Kamala Hassan as an example over here. Then, not but the least, the person whom I love a lot, it is MS Dhoni. Friends of mine always knows that because we have fought n number of times telling why Dhoni. Because Dhoni believes his heart rather than his mind. I, I feel like that. See, there is two things, heart and brain. They don't think alike. They always think differently. And Dhoni, he started listening to his heart. That is why he left his PC job and he joined for the cricket. And today, after the cricket, he started his painting. Why? Because he is happy in doing those things. Why? Because he is listening to his heart rather than his brain over here. See, we may not, may or may not success, but still, he had that courage to leave that PC job and come back and do his passion over there. Cricket, once when he found that passion, cricket was going to be his end of the career, he started into his painting. Who knows, maybe one day he will be exhibiting his painting in a museum, in an exhibition. Maybe he might be selling his uh, painting in the fats. Who knows? So that is why I have taken an example of Doni over here. A man who believes in the heart rather than in the brain. The next example, Dr. Vijay Ashwin. He is also called as five rupees doctor in Chennai. Five rupees doctor. See, he is coming from a very poor background. But still, he is a doctor. But he has a passion of coming into media. That doesn't mean that he left his job. Today, he is one among our corona warrior who is fighting for corona in Chennai today, right? He is doing it. And you know something? He is also very active in the social media. And he, is, he has more than 20 followers for him. 
where he only starts motivating because why he started that motivating was only because he wanted to be in the media media does not mean that he has to leave his doctor's job and get into media so he found another platform how he can exhibit his passion and he found that social media platform was better for him to exhibit and that is why he has done that and you remember he started even coming into tv channels where he is paid over there see being a doctor is his profession and the passion is also there which is also paying him for that he is not doing that passion for free please remember he is being paid for that we i am there in this group he has a whatsapp group i am there into his group i keep listening to those motivational and please friends is motivational language which is very simple common language where each and everybody can understand you and i can understand and that is why we love i love to follow him and he is one of the famous social media influencer today where he is making money up where he's converted his passion into his profession over here so i have dr vijay ashwin over here and that law uh when i'm talking about uh, princess diana uh here i don't think so madam i can use this madam over here as an example but still i've used madam as an example uh because again she has inspired me a lot so princess diana she comes from a royal family she has never ever believed in a royal life she always wanted to bring up their children in a middle class family pattern and she always believed her passion was helping others that is why it made me to take this as an example uh, my dear friends she helped in believing others she sold 75 of her iconic dresses just to fund as a charity to give it to aids a charity as well as for the breast cancer charities and one more thing why i used prince charles over uh, diana over here is wherever she went she used to take along with the media person the reason is the one the media used to make money that is secondary the other thing is she wanted to bring an awareness telling that hiv is no more an infectious communicable diseases so she used to visit all those places she believed that this helping others was a passion and she also believed queen of people's heart this was her quotation rather than being a queen in a palace she wanted to be a queen in the people art people that that is why her plan her passion made her to sell all those iconic and made her to sell most of her spend most of her timing in orphanages if you all remember she visited even india to most of the orphanages and she has met many people over here and definitely charles did not make make any profit over here but the attitude made me take it as an example over here that is why i have taken diana ma'am as an example here yes i these people have just left as a trial so where we can follow their footstep the footstep is always been left by the legends see there are n number of people in our entire state n number of people in our world who have converted their passion into profession but i did not take them as an example because the person when i am get and when i'm talking about somebody i should have a clear idea the content of that sir person that is why i have not taken otherwise we have n n number of person example zamita bachan is also a person a passion a maker okay we have n number of person we ha i have also a person called as uh, ratika ramaswami who from engineering she became a photographer so i we have uh, examples so again we have uh, a disability actress nakya mayuri if at all you remember i don't think so everybody remembers though she met with an accident she did not wanted to give up a passion she danced in her artificial leg 
even today she is into our uh, film industries uh, friends so whatever the examples i have spoken till now i have spoken only about movies i have spoken only about music because that was a passion and that is why i have taken that as my examples and i have given and uh, last not but not least dare to make your passion your profession and you will never have to work again it means when you take your passion as your profession you will never ever say to others that i am going to work right so this is what i wanted to tell and end my topic for today thank you for listening so if i have any questions you can start asking questions ma'am there was one more polling ha ah, sir last sir i have a question here yes ma'am yes ma'am so can we have the result ah good if passion is equal to profession plus love you will take up uh, we will will you take up passion so finally i have converted i have able to manage so can you hear me yes ma'am yes 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 finally by the end of my topic i have done i feel i have done my justification because i was able to convert that one person also into an 100 person thank you my dear friends and can we end the session sir ma'am there is there is a question in the chat box uh what the right let me see sir kusma ma'am sometimes happiness depends on state of mind that is the first question right sir yes ma'am yes yes uh sometimes happiness depends on the state of mind of course ma'am sometimes happiness definitely depends on the mind but the mind is not out of our control mind is within our control i think if we make it up we can definitely control our mind see we are not bothered why should we be least bothered about others see when you start thinking about others we will definitely not be happy we can never be happy so don't just be happy uh, don't like happiness uh, for the second for few moment maybe you will not be happy ma'am but when you try to control your mind start thinking from your heart then definitely happiness will be there now that is what we are all trying to do uh i we have ma'am is charity a profession ma'am that's what i just told you i have taken princess uh, diana only as an inspiration over here i have not told madam has converted that into profession i have just told i was inspired by ma'am and i took madam uh, princess diana as my example over here that is all it is not like a uh, madam converted into the other persons whom i gave an example they converted their passion into professions and we have one more question uh thank you ma'am you can't take make money okay that's what i would like to tell you prince uh, princess diana i took example only because of her inspiration helping others that's what, that was what i just meant to tell 
See, maybe Princess Diana's inspiration was helping others, but indirectly she was helping the media people where media people were able to make gain more during her period. I just took her as an example of a legend over here. That's it. One more question. What is the responsibility of the parent to support their children to convert passion into profession? Very good question. This is what right now I'm doing. Uh, I just put an image up. I'll just go back to that image one minute. Uh, Uh, just a second, friends. Okay. Uh, there is a question here telling what is the role of a parent in converting uh, or sorting out? I'll just read the question once. What is the responsibility of parents to support the children to convert the passion into profession? Very good. This is what I told you. I'm right now doing it. My sons. I'll just take the example of my son itself. He is very, very passionate at fashion. He wanted to go into modeling. He wanted to be one among the models. Because I have seen him many times, he's very good at dressing. Dressing sense is very good for my son. That is what I have observed. Wherever he goes, he goes neatly dressed. He never goes out just like that. He sees that everything matches for him. He's very good at uh, dressing sense. And he wanted to be a modeler. And my role as a parent, I have told him, just finish with your BE. Have a degree in your hand. Then take a break there. After completing your BE, take a break. Go into your passion. Go into your modeling field. If you start, establishing there if you start gaining your reputation there if you feel you're very happy go ahead with, i have told him go ahead with your passion if you don't shine in your if you don't shine in your modeling field please come back because you always have a degree in your hand. You always have a B certificate in your hand. So uh, I hope you have got the answer. Uh, Ma'am, uh, the reason why I asked is, every neither, uh, neighbor people will be uh, like uh, all the parents, uh, including my parents were like this. Okay, uh -huh. so I told him you have to take a break there Please, so called money and Tivala. I have told him, I have given him full freedom. No, no, now, most, most of the engineers who have the certificate does not have money today. Yes, yes. Delhi, 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 degree passion. See, success rate and Togondaga now, passion and Markon Togo, sir. If you are very lucky, we will shine in our passion, sir. But our passion and our Madwek on the Manil support Rebeku. Manil support it to on the Hiladre, definitely you can go ahead with your passion. Yes, Kavita, ma'am. Ma'am, good human being is also passion. Ma'am, being a good human being is also passion. I don't have an answer for this. Yes, of course. 
because in nowadays in this mechanical life it is hard for us to find a human being with a good heart because everything is becoming a materialistic everybody is bothered about oneself and not if at all i don't have uh, like not if all 90% of us are least bothered what is happening in our next house so being a human being a good human being is also a passion only according to me maybe for others may not sir any other question yes meena ma'am i have one uh, small okay. question ha ah, sir uh ma'am uh, as of my knowledge concern uh a passion is controllable and uncontrollable passion controllable and uncontrollable passion okay so can you give an examples for both uh, controllable and uncontrollable passion ma'am a passion can be controllable and uncontrollable yes yes of course now for me it is only happy for me or is i don't have an answer for this happy girish sir yes ma'am adre neeve answer kodtira nodri as per my my way my my way of thinking concern ah see uh, the people or the person who will be happy always the person who will be happy always okay being happiness is a kind of a passion being a enthusiasm is a kind of a passion you know so when suddenly any bad incident happens mm. okay so you will control is all passion of course right of course of course you will control what is what is yes. happening how, how this passion will affect their so definitely See, controllable. We have another different controllable. Controllable and uh, uncontrollable. Controllable is gives you happiness. Uncontrollable, mm. you are not able to achieve your happiness. Right. Right. Interesting. I just give you gave you an example in the beginning. See, controllable. I am very very happy at listening my music. This is my controllable. But okay. I was not able to make it as a profession. Mm. that was my uncontrollable because of lack of all those things you know an incident i to adike nan adan madak aagilla anta heladre nanna idralli nan adane example aagi nimage kottiddu andre right now what i am doing is not my passion okay you are all forced into something okay okay ma'am right i don't think so i have justified but whatever i know i have given no no answer. no ah, of course yes yes you are right with your answer ma yes but right uh, compare passion and profession with money as a parameter uh i don't know who gave this is it right to compare passion and profession with money see passion and profession comparisons i don't agree okay it is not a healthy comparisons between passion and profession but i i just told you we don't only believe in life we believe in livelihood see when you have to do something you should be happy only for that is the reason when you start loving your things or when you start uh, converting your love into your profession then you start doing n number of things into that so definitely nobody can say no i am into my passion and i'll be sitting at home nobody will get you every day is at bread and butter who will give us who will give us immediately after 22 years you will be chucked out of your houses asking you to go and get back get your own bread and butter over there bread and butter over there money motivates everything over here so money is very important for us so i cannot say i have a passion and i'll be sitting at home and you'll be giving me bread and butter every day that cannot be done every day so sometimes see if you don't want to get ontara ishtane ilde bandu nan job al kutkondu duddu gosra bellu 
ಬಿಲ್ಲು ಅಂತ ನಾನ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡ್ ಹೋಗ್ತೀನಿ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳದಾಗ ದಟ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ಸ್ ಅ ಪ್ರೊಫೆಷನ್ ಅದನ್ನೇ ನಾವು ಪ್ಯಾಶನ್ ಆಗಿ ಕಂಪೇರ್ ಮಾಡ್ಲೇಬೇಕಾಗತ್ತೆ ಪ್ಯಾಶನ್ ಅನ್ನ ಪ್ರೊಫೆಷನ್ ಮಾಡ್ಲೇಬೇಕು ಅಂದ್ರೆ ದನ್ ವಿ ಕೆನ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಮನಿ ಅವಯ್ಯ ಹಲೋ ಮ್ಯಾಮ್ ಮೋಟಿವೇಶನ್ ಆ ಹಲೋ ಮ್ಯಾಮ್ ಹಲೋ ಹಲೋಟ್ so what, that is what i felt about passion and profession in terms See, of money the passion is it right ma'am one thing what i'm talking over here is the topic is passion to profession i do agree passion is the thing what you love you don't expect anything but we are not talking about only that we are talking today how this passion can be converted into profession that is the topic so we just don't want the passion to lie idle we want that passion to make into profession that is what we are trying to do that any question can i hand up the session yes ma'am yes 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 yaro yaro dodda gond kalsavre lucky are those who have converted their passion into profession and have become successful in that but it is not the same with everyone and at all the time yes this is what i told you the achieving rate ajit sir kelidralla degree enike ma'am nimma maganige avanige passion annodu starting alle kodubodagittalla anta that is the answer for this lucky are those who have followed their passion anta heladre avarige ashte they would have identified their passion in their, in their early life and they would have got a better backup over there that is why they have converted their passion into profession i do agree this they would have got a correct path over there with that path they would have been able to do but everybody cannot do it but it is not impossible also it can be made possible when we have a better backup when there is a complete support from our family complete support from an in and around us definitely we can make that impossible into possible now adit sir can i wind up yes ma'am yes ma'am yes ma'am done uh, uh, thank you my dear friends whatever the questions i have uh, got and whatever the answer i have given i it is only for as per my knowledge i have given i don't know whether i have justified your answer questions or not but uh, uh, thanks i would like to thank uh, my our principal uh, anandama ma'am as well as our technical sessions that is girish sir ajit sir and kiran sir so today's webinar whatever i have done whatever the few technical i have learned it is all because of these three persons so my sincere thanks to our uh, principal as well as for my technical sessions thank you kiran sir thank you ajit sir and thank you girish sir and also uh, thanks to all my friends who have spared all your one and a half hours into my webinar class thanks to one and all over here thank you ಕಿರಣ್ ಸರ್ ಸರ್ ಕಿರಣ್ ಸರ್ ಇಲ್ಲ ಓಕೆ ಶಾಲಿ ವೈಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ ದೆನ್ ಎಸ್ ದೆನ್ ಎಸ್ 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 ಓಕೆ ಓಕೆ ಮಂಡೆ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಅ ಸೆಷನ್ फ्रॉम ಪ್ರತ್ಯೂಷ ಮ್ಯಾಮ್ ಎಸ್ ಸೋ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಪೋಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಬೈ ಟುಡೇ ಈವನಿಂಗ್ ಆರ್ ಟುಮಾರೋ ಇನ್ 